if everything is web driven, web interface driven, and you're comfortable with the APIs that we offer you, you don't have to write any Rust. If you want to integrate a shiny library from the Rust ecosystem or write your own uh, for perfect random number generation or something, then, you know, you, you have to learn a little bit of Rust. And I think, and, and this is something we were actually talking about in the working group today, it's not just me. We think that because you don't need to write Rust from the beginning, you can make your entire app this way just by you know, using the APIs that you consume and writing a configuration file in JSON. It lowers the barrier to entry because you can say you have now built a Rust-based application. And just being able to say this is kind of one of those visualization techniques of getting better at things is understanding that, yes, you are capable of doing it. And the fact is people get interested by it. Like over the, the three years we've been working on this project, a couple people have very visibly improved in their rust. They, at the beginning, they're like, this is hard. Everything is hard if you've never done it before. And having Tauri as a gateway to understanding, well, okay, I need a compiler. Why do I need a compiler? Well, having a compiler is good because it makes my app small. Great. So you get that out of the way. And then you discover that, oh, maybe there's this special custom feature that you want to make. And you follow the instructions and you write a couple lines of Rust and the compiler's like, oh, you did it wrong. And you're like, oh, okay, what did I do? Oh, that's what I did wrong. And you figure it out and suddenly you've written a couple lines of Rust. So I, I see... Tauri and, and projects like Tauri that offer an easy access to a complicated language paradigm as a definite win, not only for people who want to learn Rust, but also for those advanced projects that absolutely need Rust engineers. Suddenly, we're able to provide a marketplace for Rust engineers to go out and get jobs. Okay, maybe not suddenly. It might take a few mm -hmm. months. We just got the 1.0, but uh, I think that it's definitely a way forward. It's a way to grow as an engineer.